Okay, now again, back to the slides. This slide is simply formalizing what we just did. So in step one, you compute the downsets. If they are all comparable, we know P is an interval order. If there are two that's, which are not incomparable, then you look inside and you find the two plus two. All right. When you have completed step one, you know the answer. But when the answer is positive, you don't know the representation. Then you have to do step two, and you, you label the downsets 1 to m. Then you repeat for the upsets, but label them from large to small 1 to m. Then take the representation. x goes to interval i when d of x gets labeled i and u of x gets labeled j. There's some details in here. Why does this give you an interval? Why is the number of downsets equal to the number of upsets? OK. I'm leaving those details for you to ponder. They all work. <laughs>